Welcome to Liberty Land. I'm back from the dead again. And I'm Des. And today we're going to be making a Midwest staple. Ranch. Let's get cracking. All right, from the like five minutes I took trying to figure out how to make ranch, uh, I found out that the main things you need are buttermilk, mayo, and sour cream. In equal parts, for the most part, what I saw, so... <laughs> oh man. Technical difficulty. Equal parts. I'm already fast forward this. How am I supposed to equal part this if I'm not even fucking... Measuring? What? That You're a maniac. You're a maniac. No, I don't fucking measure anything, dude. He measures with his heart. When I cook, I don't measure shit. That's why we'll never be able to pass our recipes down to our children. I literally set my stove on fire. <laughs> I got so. excited. <laughs> the mayo came. <laughs> the mayo got excited. It on his shirt. A lot of food's gross when you think about it, so I don't think about you it. You know what my favorite is? I hate Subway because they're not... Everyone always tells me, Bro, you get to make your own sandwich. Why the fuck do you hate it? It's because their ingredients are fucking nasty. Shit's just fucking gross. So Who's like... Greedy? What? The ingredients. Oh. Why? I used to work there, so I it get just, it. It's just, it's just, I don't know. Anytime I go to Subway, like, I'll eat it. And I'm like, yeah, this is all right. And then, I'm like, a half hour later, I'm like, yeah, I think I'm just going to go fucking throw up. What? Every time. I think they're good. Like. I have never had that problem. But you'll also know when I get on mine, I don't get the chicken. Chicken's fucked up and gross. Don't get it. Oh, no. I even just if, get the lunch meat. What? Even if or you just the get the. chicken. Even if you just get fucking cold cuts. No, it's still gross. Okay, we have our base for our ranch. Next, we need a lemon. I have a lemon. And make sure to roll your lemon, because apparently that gets more of the juice out. I don't know if that's factual or not, but I def definitely just roll the shit. All right, our lemon's in. Uh, I was too lazy to chop up garlic. So I just have garlic paste. We're just gonna put a little, little jism of that. Yeah, that's good. You can add more garlic if you like garlic. I'm not a garlic fan. I'm gonna do a little more. That's probably too much already. I fucking hate garlic. All right, onion powder. It's, yeah, it's cause she's white, okay? <laughs> I'm not white, so I know good fucking taste. Garlic is not everything, white people. It's not. Next we have dill. And if you're in the upper Midwest area, you'll know that literally every fucking store is out of dill right now. Because otherwise I'd be using fresh, not dried. One day we're gonna have dough growing in our backyard and you're gonna have a smell it every day. I'm gonna smell it every day, yeah, I know. Um, but we do have fresh parsley because stores still have that because white people don't know what it is. All right, and now the last thing we need is the bane of most white people's existence in the kitchen. Salt and pepper. Not a lot, just enough to taste. What? You just throw in the extreme amounts of shade. Well, yeah, because it's funny. <laughs> People forget all the time in Discord that I'm Hispanic. So like, I just like to, you know, take some time to reinforce it. So are you not gonna taste this now? I feel like I want to taste it, but I can't taste it. Well, that... Marissa, you have to try it. To tell You're me. the connoisseur. You have to try it. Um, literally, you need the most amount of mayo. You need half a cup of mayo and quarter cup of the other stuff. 
Really? Yeah. Okay, the one, like, I read three of them that were, like, equal parts each. No, all of them, it's, like... Well, I suppose mayo is very, like, not... It's, like, a very neutral. Yeah, it, it levels off the taste, yeah. Technical difficulty! Okay. Ranch. Okay, I'm not gonna try this ranch because next week, Des and I are putting this ranch up to the test to uh, five other kinds of ranches to see which ranch is the best. So we'll see you then. Until next time, stay free. It's some good ass beer. That's good. Yeah. Pew, pew, pew.